everybody. I hope you're feeling really um, happy and lovely today. Um, welcome to Yoga Kids. This is Vinci. Vinci, this is Florence. And we're going to do some really cool yoga poses. Are you ready to join us today for some yoga fun? <coughs> Yay! Okay. We're going to start off as we always do, stood up nice and tall so you can have your feet together or you can have your feet hip width apart. Okay, and then we're going to have our really strong hands, so Vincenzo, hands down nice and strong. And we're going to start to breathe in through the nose. Are we ready? Big breath in. Well done. In through the nose. Out. So breathe in happiness. Breathe out anything you want to get rid of. Inhale a couple more times. Wow, very good. Keep breathing through the nose. And then we're going to place now the hands. We're going to interlace them, put them under our chin, and we're going to be like dragons. Okay, are we ready? We're going to take a big breath in, and then we're going to go and blow out all of that fire. Are we ready again? Big breath in through the nose. Blow out the fire. <sighs> One more time. Can we lean forward when we do it so we can really blow? Big breath through the nose. Out through the mouth. <sighs> Excellent. Okay, shake your hands and shake your feet. We'll hop around. Have a little shake of your hips. Little shake of your shoulders. Shake it. Wonderful. <coughs> We've got to do the sun salutation because the sun's shining. What a gorgeous day. All right, are you ready to follow through? So let's go. Take the hands up into the air. Good. And give the sun a nice big wave and say thank you for coming out. And we're going to now paint a beautiful rainbow for all of those um, wonderful nurses and doctors and um, workers that are helping us during this time. So a nice big rainbow of gratefulness and compassion. Let's go, over we go. Excellent. And then we're gonna come all the way down and the floor's a little bit dirty. So we're gonna have to come all the way down and we're gonna have to sweep the floor with the hands. That's it, good. Okay, we're gonna now do a little change on the sun salutation. We're gonna jump back, jump back into our plank pose. And then we're going to drop the knees down and we're going to lower down like very, very quiet snakes. And we're going to then breathe in through the nose, lift up and go. <laughs> That's it. Down we go again. But this time we're going to change into a seal. So we're going to straighten the arms out now. Are we ready? Big breath in. Straight arms like a seal. What noises do seals make? Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Can we hear your seal noises, everybody? Ready? Go. Let's lower down nice and gently. And then we're going to enter into our. What are we going to go into? Yeah. Downward facing dog. Yeah. Are you lifting your bottoms up? Give it to her. Whack your tail from yeah. side to side. That's it, and we're gonna hop forward. Whoop. But we're gonna stay down like little froggies. We're gonna be really quiet, little froggies. Sat on a lily pad, and then we're gonna be sat there. We're gonna bring our hands to our heart center and see if we can balance. Good breathing, Vincenzo. Really breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth, and then all of a sudden, we're gonna hop into life. We're gonna go hop, hop. And then go down again. And ready? One, two, three, hop up again. Hop. Excellent. And then keep really, really quiet. Good. Okay. And then we're going to creep back up. See so your arms come up. We're going to come up nice and slowly. Big breath in. Reach the arms up. Feet face forward. Big tummy breath in. Exhale, hands to heart center. Good. Can we put our two little fingers together like this? It's hot, isn't it, today? It's lovely. I'm going to strip off too as well, then, Chanda. <laughs> okay. So, <clears throat> let's take our hands into our mudra. So, this is called a Kali mudra. And you put two index fingers together. And we're just going to see 
And imagine that this is a candle. So we're going to drop the shoulders down, hold this up, and we're going to take a big breath in, and we're going to see if we can blow out the candle. Are we ready? Mine's not gone out. Has yours? Nick, yeah. has yours? Yeah. Yes. Oh, right. Okay, because you've been doing really good breathing today. Should we go again one more time? Big breath in. Big breath out. Wonderful. Okay, sweep the arms up. Big breath in. And then forward fold, nice and slowly. And this time, we're going to come into a high lunge. So step the left foot back. Don't drop the knee. Don't drop the knee. Keep it nice and strong. And see if you can balance like a warrior now. We're going to have to turn into warriors. And big hands up. So you can be whatever warrior you want to be. And when it builds muscles in the legs, that's it. Good. And then we're going to send the right arm forward. Left arm back. Turn. And we're going to come into our warrior too. Okay. So the right knee is bent. Left leg is back. Pull in your tummies. And look forward. We always look to the future, never to the past. Always the future. And then bring the hand around. Good. And now you can drop your left knee. <laughs> oh, that's better. And then we're going to raise the arms up. And then bring the hands to heart center. Now we're going to come into um, what we call an ostrich pose <clears throat> or a pyramid pose, whatever you want to call it. We're going to now. Step up with that left leg, keep the right leg straight, left leg straight. See if you can feel a really nice stretch running through the spine. Bend your right knee if you find you've got tight hamstrings. That's it. See if you can stretch it. And then we're going to jump and we're going to go whoop, like that. Ooh, that's it. And swap it. Wow, I've got tight hamstrings today. Okay, work. Yeah, so you're probably feeling that you've got tight hamstrings. Okay, let's drop to the floor. If any of you do gymnastics, if any of you um, work a lot, should we try and stretch our hamstrings? Because I think a lot of us, yes, I think a lot of us have tight hamstrings. So let's see if we can stretch them. Our hamstrings are those big muscles at the back of the thighs, and sometimes they get very, very tight. So if we just bend that right knee forward, yeah, or left, whatever you want to do, and then just gently take it back. Okay, and then gently come forward and just see where your hands go and see if you can feel a tightness underneath that leg. Yeah, and we can you feel a tightness there? Yeah, so we just have to breathe here. Now, this is where yoga is really good. We breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. One more breath. Keep it going, Vincenzo. And then swap. So swap legs. That's it. Good. Stretch it out. So can come forward. That's it. Can you feel all that tightness there? All right, one more breath. Excellent. Right, let's step to the top of the mat. I think we need a little bit of fun now, don't you? <laughs> okay, we're going to bring in, first of all, just roll your shoulders back a little bit. Okay, and then just turn and twist a little bit to the left and right. Okay, make sure that you feel warm enough. Everything is stretched. Just shake your hands up and then back down again. Shake your leg up, whoop, back down and the other one up and back down. Good. Okay, we're going to come into what we call bird of paradise pose. So I'm going to demonstrate this, but you need to be sufficiently warmed up. It's really, really important. So just make sure that um, you're nice and warm. Jump up and down if you don't feel warmed up enough. And we're going to, I'm going to demonstrate what you do. Are we ready? <clears throat> so, what we do, I if I do it from sideways on, it's probably better. So, we're going to come into um, what we call our high lunge, what we did before. And we're going to come forward. And we're going to lift the arms up like this. And then we're going to come forward again. And we're going to take the right hand under the right leg. And then interlace that with the left hand. Okay, so just practice doing that first, bounding underneath. Are we ready? Okay, <laughs> so let's have a go. Right, so you need to bend that knee. That's it. 
Right, this hand's got to come underneath. Bend that right knee. Oh. That's it. Try that. Now Florence is going to demonstrate beautifully <laughs> the bird of paradise. So if you want to demonstrate, okay. Florence, try it again. So have a go. You step that left foot through. And then you find your balance and you lift up. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Excellent. So keep practicing. That's called the bird of paradise. Yeah. Yes. Um, you have your right knee forward, left foot back. Okay. You take your arms up. You come forward. The knee that's bent, the right hand comes down. And then this hand joins behind. And you just, I'm going to do here. And we lift up. And we hold up. Wow. Roll of the shoulders. To practice, work on. I'm extremely hot. Are you extremely hot? Yeah. Time for, I think, you can choose. What would you like? Oh, yay. What yoga pose is your favourite yoga pose? Let me know. In, go on. Um, um, a handstand. Oh, yes. Okay, let's have a go at a handstand. If you have space in your room, just be careful. But just be careful. Well done. Okay, watch the light. Oh, do it. Do the other way round. That's it. Are we ready? Just be careful. Very good. Excellent. That's another yoga. <laughs> All right. All right. Best to do outside. Oh wow, that was a good one. That was right. a bit pretty. Can we stand up now, please? Oh, okay. Step nice and straight in mountain pose. Hands down. <laughs> Best to do the handstands outside for health and safety reasons, not inside. Okay, and always make sure that you have an adult when you're practicing, um, supervising you. Okay, so time for relaxation now. It's been quite hardcore yoga kids today, but it's been fun. Let's come into child's pose. So let's bend the knees <coughs> and then gently curl up into a little ball. <coughs> That's it. Wonderful. Okay. And we're going to have a nice little story now. So we're going to imagine today that we're going to be in a beautiful, beautiful tropical paradise. And there are so many beautiful parrots around with lovely different colours. And you are in this beautiful desert island. And beneath the beach or behind the beach is a tropical lagoon. And the water is so clear and beautiful. And it's very shallow, so it's very safe. But it's so warm. So you go to sit on the edge and you dip your toes in and you relax your shoulders and you let your fingers just dip into the water. And you close your eyes and you just have a minute or so breathing here. And you can hear all the parrots squawking in the background. You can hear all the beautiful birds and the smells of the beautiful, lush leaves and trees, you can hear the waves and gently just brushing along the shore and back. And the sun is shining down and it's the perfect temperature. And you feel really happy, really strong and so relaxed. And you take a couple more deep breaths here. You feel so secure. And you can invite whoever you want to now into your, into your world. Give them a nice hug. And then gently now, you decide that if you're so relaxed and so happy and calm, then it's time to go back to your present day. So when you're ready, you can gently... Okay, that's it. Just roll the shoulders back. After all that physical exercise. And then take a big breath in, reach your hands up, exhale, hands to heart centre. And then, okay, we're going to just finish with the norm and then we're going to have a couple of shout outs. Okay, so take your Jana Mudra, thumb, 
Index finger. I'll be ready. Sit up nice and tall. <coughs> oh. Okay. Thank you so much. Can't wait to see you all again next Tuesday. Would you like to shout out Vincenzo? Well, Joe Thompson. Well, Joe Thompson. Okay. And Virginia Lucy and Poppy. All right. Thank you so much for joining us. Okay, we'll see you all next week. Big wave. Bye. Bye. Bye.